Hi everyone, welcome to iCarmelo Designs, Yvette here. I hope you guys are doing great. I want to thank you for stopping by and taking a look at my video. I want to share today a design team project that I've made for I Am Roses. And um, without any further ado, I want to show you this because I'm really excited. Um, I've been on vacation for the past few weeks. And while on vacation, I found a couple of things that are alterable. And um, one of them was a spoon set. And let me show you. Here's one of them. And it's just an older spoon. And it says that it's silver plated. But anyway, I've seen people altering spoons in the past. And I really wasn't into it until I took like a really good look at one. And then I found the spoons. And I was like, oh, okay, this is great. So for 10 cents, <laughs> I made this wonderful project and um, I used my beautiful I Am Roses products and let me show you, let me grab some of the things that I use to show you first. So I use these tiny roses and they come in little bunches like this and it's um, three different kinds. I'll show you the third one in just a second. Or actually here's one, this um, little light yellow, white and these tiny little yellow ones. And I used most of them up in my project. And I also use these tiny little flowers. Oops, let's see, what did I do with them? I use these guys right here. And I'll have numbers and such on my blog so you guys can take a look at that if you'd like. And you can find me over at yvettecarillo.blogspot.com. So this is what I've made. So I've taken this, as you can obviously see, I gave it a sharper bend so it's already bent but I went ahead and I just you know um, I played with it until I got the bend that I needed and um, I have these cute little letters that I wrote my name with and that is from it's let's see bottle cap incorporated and I think I picked this up and this is the vintage edition and I think I picked this up from Hobby Lobby so when it comes in a package like this and you have uh, a bunch of letters so I went ahead and I added letters on here as you can see and I backed it up so that it's finished in the front and in the back and what I did is I took my graphic 45 uh, once upon a springtime paper collection and I added that to the back of it so if you look at the letters they come unfinished like so so here's a K and then behind that it's just unfinished wood and on the front I just added some of my vintage um, photo distress ink to make it kind of old and as you can see I took a bunch of the little mini roses and I added them here and my cute little flower so pretty right there and here for the piece this is what I did so I took some Spanish moss and I added it inside of the spoon before I did that I added some what was it some dimensional stickers in there so that I didn't have to put that much Spanish moss in there then I went to my computer and I cut out where I printed out this little cute vintage Victorian girl and as you can see I added some some of my what did I use I used glitter but it was the Stampin' Up one so here it is it's Dazzling Diamonds and I added that and I'm not sure if the camera is really picking that up but it's super super shiny. Then I added a little piece of ephemera from another um, little vintage picture that I printed out. Then I printed out with my typewriter font Fairy Love and as you can see I added those there and then I added this cute little mushroom right here that my friend Marlene gave me and more of the roses and this is my project so if you want to stick around I have a video of me making it for you to check out thanks so much for stopping by take care and have a wonderful week